This is Chris Wall, Doctor of Audiology at Soundpoint, Tucson, Arizona. I'm going to show you how to pair a Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus to made for iPhone hearing aids. Now, if you've already tried this, unpair the hearing aids and then turn off the Bluetooth and power down the Android phone. Put your hearing aids in the charging cradle or open the battery door to turn them off. Power the Android phone back on and enter the uh, passcode, which the user will do now. Now it's important to follow my instructions very closely here or you'll keep failing at this. <laughs> You can give me a call, email me, I'll show you how to do it. All right, you got the phone turned back on. No hearing aids are paired, Bluetooth is turned off, okay? Okay, you're gonna go into the Bluetooth menu and you're gonna pull the hearing aids off the charger, close the battery doors to activate them set them close to the phone, and turn the Bluetooth on. Bluetooth searches, it's found, James's hearing aids. Select only one hearing aid and wait 30 seconds. Start counting. Make sure 30 seconds has elapsed before you select the second hearing aid. If you select the second hearing aid before 30 seconds, it will fail and will only stream to one hearing aid. This is the step there, the Android combines the hearing aids into a single entity of some sort. Wait 30 seconds. When exactly 30 seconds has elapsed, touch the second hearing aid, it pairs it. Now watch, they will become one. If you've done it successfully, you've now paired your made for iPhone hearing aids to a Samsung Galaxy S10 with 10 operating system and you can stream. Go ahead and open up the app for your hearing aid. In this case, it'd be the Thrive app, Starkey Livio AI2400 hearing aids. Agree to the terms and allow permission for location. Select the hearing aids, connect. Select the mode, advanced. You can skip this step or you can fill in this, this in and read about it. These are things you can do with the app. And there you're in. Turn up and down the volume and access. I'll post other videos about how to use this particular app. But as you can see, it's working great. You can make phone calls with it.